President Biden had what appeared to be a slightly tense exchange with his press secretary, Karine Jean-Pierre, as he responded to a reporter's question regarding Israeli involvement in the humanitarian crisis in Gaza, as reported by Conservative Brief on Thursday, October 19, 2023. The incident occurred as the world watched the escalating conflict between Israel and Hamas. A reporter aboard Air Force One questioned President Biden, asking, You said you were very blunt with the Israelis on the need to get humanitarian aid to Gaza or what exactly? In response, President Biden replied, On everything, ha ha ha. However, during this exchange, Karine Jean-Pierre, the White House press secretary, appeared to interrupt the president prompting a noticeable reaction from him. President Biden's tone shifted as he responded with a stern, don't. Jean-Pierre, seemingly acknowledging the moment, replied, sorry, sir. Following this exchange, President Biden shifted the discussion towards the evacuation of American citizens from the conflict region. He expressed hope in facilitating the safe return of Americans from Gaza while also exploring other avenues to bring them back. The State Department has been actively working to organize the evacuation of American citizens from Israel amidst the ongoing conflict with the terrorist group Hamas. However, the evacuation process comes with a caveat. American citizens will be required to pay for their flights, raising questions and concerns. This approach has triggered criticism from some political figures. Georgia Republican Rep. Marjorie Taylor Greene, in an interview on the John Solomon Report podcast, pointed out similarities to the situation in Afghanistan when American citizens were left stranded as the U.S. military withdrew. She raised concerns about Americans stranded in Israel and cited reports of Americans being murdered by Hamas, further emphasizing the need for a robust and effective evacuation strategy. The State Department, on the other hand, has defended the decision to charge for the chartered evacuation flight. According to a spokesperson, the department's top priority is ensuring the safety and security of U.S. citizens overseas. They emphasize their ongoing communication with citizens in need and outline the process for evacuation, including loans for departure assistance and reimbursement of expenses as required by U.S. law. As the humanitarian crisis in Gaza continues to unfold, the exchange between President Biden and his press secretary has drawn attention. The conversation highlighted the complexities and challenges faced by the U.S. government in managing the evacuation of American citizens during ongoing conflicts abroad. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube Chanel Jack CN24. Thank you for watching.